Hi, Ray. Hey, Lars. <clears throat> Guess I should change my background. Excuse me. Yeah, I was trying to help John, uh, Jonathan get in. Um, I hope I resent the invitation to him a couple minutes ago. Sent it twice now. Great. God, you get younger every time, Lars. What are you doing? Um, Must be a good health plan, huh? Uh, it's certainly not by getting a lot of sleep. <laughs> well, your day, your nights are getting longer, aren't they? You should have lots of time to sleep. Our nights are getting longer. Yes, indeed, they are. Um, uh, we we're not going into um, into uh, daylight savings, or I mean, changing back to the original until end of this month. So, uh -huh. so these days uh, we're just slowly. Oh, another Lars. Uh, hello. Yeah, Jonathan. I don't know what's happened there. I haven't received any emails from you, Richard. Um, I don't know if my. Yes, yeah, sorry. Are uh, you Jonathan? Yeah. Okay, I'll Jonathan. rename you. Jonathan, you've got a, a burr on your microphone. Is is have you you are you using an external mic? So that might be not completely uh, where it's not uh, in the socket, maybe or. So what's happening? Sorry, you lost. Yeah, might be better though. But you have to say some more for, for us to <laughs> hear the difference. Can you hear me okay now, Lars? You yeah. have distortion, Jonathan, in, in your microphone. Um, yeah. Right. Um, Is that any better? Can you hear me okay now? No, that was actually worse, to be honest. No, it's... I've, I've just unplugged the, the microphone. And maybe if you, uh, I don't know where on your table, if but it, if you place it um, somewhere just below your chin, maybe it's it's probably won't be in sight, but uh, it would will be closer to your mouth. Is it on a stand, maybe, or is um is it this? Can you hear me okay now, Lars? Yeah, there's still some distortion, but um, you just sound extremely sexy. <laughs> <laughs> I can live with that. Mm. Hello, Yvonne. Greetings, Yvonne. Hi. Hi. Hi you can Jim. hear me fine, right? Yes, indeed. Yes, yes. Okay. Hey, Lars. Hello, hey, Jim. Yvonne. Hi, Jonathan. Hey, Rick. Hi. Hi, Jim. <clears throat> my, uh, my young colleague will be here soon, I suppose. David? <laughs> yes. Lars, you probably would have enjoyed our, our Peruvian shamans last week talking about what health means to them. It was a oh. real eye-opener and, and how to mm. create health in yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was, it was very, very down-to-earth common sense. I mean, it just wasn't yeah. any out there in cosmology, but just achieving a balance it, mm. internally at three different levels inside yourself and three aspects of yourself. So sort of a, um, a, a guide to mental health. Um, yeah, in, in <laughs> I think stages. that's what they were doing, right, Jim? <laughs> yeah. yeah, well, it was interesting that the, the um, moderator, a guy by the name of Ray Christ uh, from Greece, uh, was diagnosed with four 
fourth stage cancer, terminal cancer. And um, he said, I'm just not going to just go away and die. And he went on a search, ended up uh, in Peru. And he met uh, 